I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Hello, it's John Mead, here, and you are watching the Daily News. The Franklin Heights Drama Club is pleased to announce that the play performances featuring the audition and check please are this Friday at 7 p.m. and Saturday at 7. The show is scheduled for Saturday at 3. Is canceled. Sorry. Tickets are $4 for students and $7 for adults. Please note that tickets are for immediate family only due to the 15% capacity mandated by the state of Ohio. Tickets must be purchased online at the web address in the video description. Tickets will not be sold at the door. Picture retakes are scheduled for next Monday for the Blue Group and next Friday for Green Group. Students must bring their original packet. The Franklin Heights High School Marching Band entered the Central State Judges Association 2020 Virtual National Marching Band Championship, that's a name, along with 29 other bands. The Golden Falcons submitted a video of their performance at the Lancaster High School Invitation on October 10, 2020, and they were awarded first place in music, second place in general effect, percussion and auxiliary, and second place overall in the 4A class. See the video description for a link to the performance. How does one million dollars sound? Pretty good, right? Did you know that someone with a college degree will earn on average one million dollars or more over a lifetime than someone with just a high school diploma? It's never too early to start planning for education beyond high school. This week is College Application Week at Franklin Heights. To start the week on a winning note, we will be testing your college knowledge at lunch. Be ready to play college lingo bingo after you eat. Good morning, guys. Get ready for your daily sports news. Special Olympics is offering an inclusive opportunity for you while sports are the core mission for Special Olympics. To be a high school performing athlete, your health and fitness must be a priority. Please consider joining this <laughs> nine-week fitness opportunity. This challenge will allow Special Olympic athletes, partners, and coaches to start the health, wellness, fitness journey that they may be looking for. Each interested athlete, partner, and coach will receive their own kit where they can utilize different health and fi fitness activities at home. What is Fit5? This program is five days of exercise. This can be physical exercises such as taking a walk or mental exercise as playing trivia games. This also includes fruits and vegetables five days a week and drinking water five days a week. There will be a tracking sheet that you will find out on a weekly basis and can be turned into Aaron Henson <laughs> each week to be submitted to Special Olympics. The athlete, partner, or coach with the most points will receive an award from each region. Please stop in room 1215 to see Aaron Hetchen if you would like to participate in this and to pick up your materials. Franklin Heights softball is back three days a week, Mondays and Fridays in the batting cage and Wednesdays in the weight room from 345 to 530. They're hoping to see some new faces. Today's weather we will have a low of 34 and a high of 50. It's KT here. I'm bringing you today's lunch, which will be chicken patty sandwich with green beans or tall salad. 
Also remember all breakfasts and lunches are free through December 31st. Happy birthday today to Sania McClendon, Preston Elliott, Ingrid Hernandez, Alexis Urban, and Sarah Tippett. Thanks for watching Franklin Heights Daily News.